Hello you guys, so I'm going to share this dream with you guys really quick. Um, God wanted me to share this dream, and honestly I really didn't want to share it because it's kind of weird and it's kind of crazy. And I really hope that um, people kind of just shove it off as weird and crazy because it's got some information in it that I really just didn't want to throw out there because of just risk. Um, but I gotta do what God tells me to do. So the dream starts off with that I'm in this class, like this college class, and we go out to this park. And as we're out in this park, we're walking around this park, and all of a sudden, in the horizon, this portal opens up. And I'm like, everybody look at the portal, look at the portal. And these guys run up to me, and they're like, no, 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 don't look at this portal, don't, don't, just don't look at it. And I'm like, yeah, but don't you see it? And they're like, yeah, we see it too, but don't look at it. And I thought it was kind of strange that they didn't want me recognizing the portal or looking at it. And as I was looking at this portal, it was bright white. And it like was so bright white that it was like shining like rays off of it. It was so bright white. And it had like symbols in the middle of the portal like one of them was like a bird another one was like a spiral and like all of these like symbols were like tribal looking symbols like I don't know how to describe them like one was a bird one was just a regular spyware one with most of them were like spirals with like tribal looking things in the spiral I don't know how to describe it and anyway, I drew a picture of them to kind of, to show them. And I've also been to some uh, Native American Indian dwellings that have spirals on them. And they, they, in real life, I've been to Native American Indian dwellings where they say that, oh, these spirals just mean migration, but I believe they mean portals. But anyway, um, I'm back to the dream. So I'm looking at this, this portal and the, they're like, they're like, oh, no, don't look at it, don't look at it. And then so as I'm looking at it, you know, I'm seeing these spirally tribal-looking symbols. And then um, then I get my phone out, and I'm like, oh, I'm going to take a video of it. I'm going to get proof of this portal. And as I'm taking a video of it, the portal turns into, like, this completely different type of portal. It's got, like, this golden archway, and it's still a spiral in the middle. Of this golden archway and it's like a purple spirally looking kind of not so good looking and um, and then after that my dream goes to where I'm in the hallway of this college with some of the guys that were telling me you know oh don't look at the portal don't look at the portal um, we were in the hallway talking about you know the portals and one guy I remember his name is Jack from high school that I used to go to and he was there and some other guys were there and we were talking about these portals and it was almost like Jack knew something and he was trying to see how much we knew and uh, I don't remember everything that was in that particular conversation I just remember Jack was trying to figure out how much we knew about about it and then then it came to the point where we were all walking into the classroom and as we were walking into the classroom Jack said that the purple portal with the golden archway was a portal to Orlando and I was like well I've been to Orlando that's that's where I went and fed the poor and, and spread the gospel and he stopped in his tracks stopped in his tracks and he come up to me and he said whatever you do don't take the blue jacket. Do not take the blue jacket. And I'm like, okay. So we walk into the classroom, we all sit down. And it was like we were getting ready for a teaching or a lesson or whatever. Then these guys come in, two men with these blue jack like suit and tie like jackets on. And they have like a whole thing of jackets that they're handing out to everybody. And it was like they were like some secret agency or something i want to say nasa but it's not nasa it's bigger than nasa whatever this agency is it's like a men in black type thing agency 
except for like the movie Men in Black, like they were like, oh, we're going to help save the world from aliens. This organization was more like, we're going to recruit people to learn how to enslave humanity. Um, and that's what the aliens want to do kind of thing. I know it sounds kind of sci-fi, but that's what this dream was about. And God wanted me to warn people with this dream. But anyway, so they're handing out these blue suits. And it was almost like this class was... They were teaching us, you know, giving us a degree in whatever the secret agency was. And then um, me and Jack were the only ones that didn't accept this jacket. Everyone else in the class did. So that was the end of my dream. And I want to, at the end of this dream, explain to you something really quick I I'll put a, a link in the description below of the original video that I did but I'll put up some pictures here that show Elon Musk and his girlfriend she got this quote-unquote alien scar tattoo and if you look at this picture it looks like she's been infected by some sort of alien and I'll just leave it at that and this class is being is getting ready to be taught but the thing is is these kids that are going to be in this class they're going to think that it's just some really cool NASA program they're not going to think that it's this enslavement program so I just wanted to share the dream with you um but you know it's just a crazy dream it's nothing really big you know so um but God wanted me to share this dream. So God bless you guys. Take care.